Hello everyone! I'm Ayana. Today, I'll explain how to make this animation. Let's begin! Let's start! Press this button to create a new composition. You can also create a new composition by pressing Ctrl plus N. Change the composition name. Change the duration. Click OK. Press Ctrl plus I to import the file. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus F to adjust the scale to fit the composition. Press Ctrl plus the bracket key to move the selected layer up or down. Press S to display only the scale. Change the value of the property. Press P to display only the position. Change the value of the property. Press this button and select the type tool. You can also change the type tool by pressing Ctrl plus T. Change font settings. Change the paint color. Click OK. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus Home to center the anchor point. Change the name. Press P to display only the position. Change the value of the property. Press F2 to deselect all. Press this button and select the rectangle tool. You can also change the rectangle tool by pressing Q. Change the width. Change the paint color. Change the paint color. Click OK. Change the track mat. Change the name. Press Ctrl plus Alt plus Home to center the anchor point. Move the indicator. Press P to display only the position. Create a keyframe. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Search for effects in the Effects in Presets search box. Press Enter to apply the effect. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Create a keyframe.
Press numpad to select a layer. Press U to display only properties that have keyframes or expression set. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Press Ctrl plus D to duplicate. Press F2 to deselect all. Press this button and select the pin tool. You can also change the pin tool by pressing G. Change the width. Change the paint color. Change the name. Press Ctrl plus the bracket key to move the selected layer up or down. Change the track mat. Press numpad to select a layer. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus bracket key to move the selected layer to the top or bottom. Press the comma key to zoom out the composition panel. Press this button and select the pin tool. You can also change the pin tool by pressing G. Change the width. Change the paint color. Press the period key to zoom in the composition panel. Change the name. Press Ctrl plus the bracket key to move the selected layer up or down. Search for effects in the effects in presets search box. Double click to apply the effect. Change the value of the property. Click this checkbox. Change the value of the property. Search for effects in the effects in presets search box.
press enter to apply the effect. Change the value of the property. Click this list box to change. Add properties from this button. Select a property. Move the indicator. Create a keyframe. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Create a keyframe. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Press F9 to apply Easy Ease. Press this button to display the graph editor. Select Edit Speed Graph. Adjust the graph. Press Ctrl plus 0 to show or hide the project panel. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus bracket key to move the selected layer to the top or bottom. Press Shift plus shortcut to display multiple properties. Move the indicator. Create a keyframe. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Move the indicator. Change the value of the property. Press F9 to apply Easy Ease. Press the Home key to move the indicator to zero. Press Spacebar to preview. This is the end of today's lecture. See you again in the next lecture. See you soon. Bye.